皆さん、こんにちは。ニーサチャンネル、資格ハンター編です。最新の英語ニュースを読み上げますので、英語の試験勉強やスキルアップにご活用ください。Top US Diplomat, EU leaders agree to continue pressure on Moscow. March 4th, 2022, for 17 p.m. VOA News. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken and European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen participate in a media conference at EU headquarters in Brussels, March 4, 2022. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken met with leaders of the European Union on Friday, pledging with them to keep pressuring Russia with sanctions in response to its invasion of Ukraine, saying Russia's aggression is a threat relevant to the entire world. Following a similar meeting with NATO allies in Brussels, Blinken attended a special EU foreign ministers' meeting. Speaking to reporters ahead of the meeting, the top US diplomat said what is at risk with Russia's invasion, along with the lives of Ukrainians, are fundamental principles of peace and security that the world established during two world wars, which Russian President Vladimir Putin is egregiously violating every single day. Following the ministerial meeting, Blinken and European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen met with reporters. Von der Leyen ran through a series of sanctions on Russia's financial system, which she said would cut off Russia's central bank from a significant share of its reserves to bolster the plummeting ruble, the nation's currency. As a result, the bank has had to raise interest rates by 20%, driving up inflation. Action against commercial banks. Meanwhile, the country's commercial banks have been cut off from global markets and from SWIFT, the worldwide interbank communication system, curtailing their ability to finance the economy. Unfortunately and tragically, Blinken said, the war in Ukraine is not likely to be over soon, but the measures von der Leyen announced must be sustained until it stops, until the war is over, and the Russian forces leave. He said both US and EU officials were committed to doing that. Blinken said Russia's actions could not go unanswered. If we allow those principles to be violated with impunity, then we're opening a Pandora's box in every corner of the world for this to happen again and again and again, he said. Some information for this report came from the Associated Press, Reuters, and Agents France Presse. 以上で、今回のミーサチャンネルは終了です。最後までご視聴いただきまして、ありがとうございました。よろしければ、高評価とチャンネル登録をよろしくお願いします。